Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve the HDMI application or monitor TV or whatever you're trying to hook up is not showing up in your playback devices. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So you want to first start by opening up the start menu, type in sound. You want to select sound right above control panel, so you want to select that one. And then you want to see where your playback devices will center underneath playback are. So if there's one that's specifically the one that you're trying to activate, just will click on it and then left click on set as default. So once you're done with that, check and see if it's resolved the problem. If you're still experiencing a problem, you can try opening up the start menu, type in Windows Features. Best manager should come back with turn Windows Features on or off, left click on that. If you notice that Hyper-V is checkmarked, you want to just uncheck it, so make sure it's not filled in at all. Once you're done with that, left click on OK. And hopefully that should be able to resolve the problem. Another thing you can try would be to head back over to the Start menu. Type in CMD. Best match should come back with Command Prompt. You want to right click on that and then left click on Run as Administrator. If you receive a user account control window about this command prompt, you want to left click on yes. And now I'm going to have a command in the description of my video. I want you guys to copy it directly from my description. It should start with DISM and head up to the top bar of the command prompt window, right click on it, left click on edit, and then left click on paste to paste it in. Hit enter on your keyboard. And you will have to restart your computer, so just type Y on your keyboard. It should restart the computer here. And once you restart, you should be all good to go. So, as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.